What's up, y'all? Welcome to another bomb wig installation. So today we are going to be installing the Sensational What Lace Unit. And this unit, her name is Kishona. So this originally was not going to be a tutorial. Well, it's not really a tutorial, but after unboxing this wig, and just looking at it, it was completely different. And I just knew that this video would really help someone that was really trying to install this unit. And you're really not hair savvy, so you, would, you wouldn't know what to really do with it. So I decided to make this video for you guys, just to kind of give you some motivation to get your desired look. So as you can see, this unit comes with a fair amount of hair on the unit, so you can really play with it in a lot of different ways. What I recommend is that you start with getting your part where you want it and really forming the look that you want to go with. Another thing that I do like about this hair is that it does take a decent amount of heat to be a synthetic unit. So as you can see, I have pretty much molded this hair down. It lays really well and it's pretty thick. Another thing I do like about this hair is that even though it's synthetic, it does not give a fake shiny look off. That's another thing I like about this unit also. And it's also big head friendly. So if you have a larger head and maybe sometimes the wigs, you know, may feel like they're too small, this will be the perfect unit for you. Now, if you have a smaller head, this will work for you as well because it does have the bands and the combs installed in the unit. So as you can see, I have kind of sectioned the hair off so that I can cut it down in sections and keep from messing it up. Just go in with your Tinkerbell comb. It's really easy to use. And just kind of thin it down to your desired look. So thin that hair on down and get it to lay how you want it to look. I myself was going for a more simple sleep look. I do wear my hair short naturally, so I was going for something that looks a little more natural. So I decided to kind of go with a flatter look and give it like a making good bang look. Look at that bang, honey. Can you see it forming? Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> So as you can see, I really took my time on the sides and really cut that hair down with the Tinkerbell comb so that it will lay flat. This style definitely takes time, but I promise you'll get it.
So at this point, it was really starting to come together. As you can see, the hot comb is a must because it pretty much just forms it how you need it to be. I didn't really put any products on this hair because I didn't want it to get nappy or start looking shiny because it is synthetic. See, this is my favorite part of my wigs. I love a little bit of baby hair because you can really get that natural look if you do it right. So just go in with your Tinker Bell comb and cut just a minimum amount of hair and leave out and then go in with your favorite edge control. My favorite is the Jam Magic Fingers. Oh my God, this works so good on lace units. And you don't have a use have to use a lot but if you don't have any edge control just go in with your edge brush and uh, spray a little bit of guys to be on it and voila you got you some edges sis so this unit was really giving off a lot of vibes. So <laughs> pretty much anyone can rock this unit, just depending on the look you're going for. You're going to start off with Granny. <laughs> we don't want that. Auntie vibes, definitely. Mama vibes. And whatever else. But I was definitely feeling myself at this point. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. Yes, I love it. So when you get done, spray it down with a little holding spray. Or if you only have spray, spray it at a distance because you don't want it hard. We just want it to hold. So this is it, guys. I'm really satisfied with the look. I definitely love me a good wig. And this is how the bag looks. I wanted to show you a flat foundation picture of how you really need to braid your hair down to get a flatter look. My hair had big braids because I was wearing a larger wig. So for a flat look, make sure your braids are small. And thank you so much for watching.